Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look, there's been some things. We've had a formal, we've had an athletics day. That's uh, about it, but it was all something. All together, I reckon it's a year that we'll remember for both good and bad. Mostly bad. Yeah. <laughs> but maybe like, it's not a like, bad idea to just quickly reflect. Uh, what are you going to miss most about St. Engine College? Probably school sport. Okay, why? What is basically everything? <laughs> so Alana, what are you going to miss most about St. Eugene College? Seeing everyone's faces every day. So Sam, your favourite um, memory from St. Eugene College? Getting chased by Mr. Neen down the creek. Why do I remember that? Because he's a 10 tenner. <laughs> definitely got to be seeing Miss Phipps walking around with our faces on a mug. Most about this year? Odd for Angie's Definitely, body. yeah, for Angie's arms. Yeah, <laughs> muscular man. <laughs> Uh, I guess just the people, you know, people? Mm -hmm. yeah, because, you know, there's a lot of people here. Yeah, I'll miss, I'll miss Nick, I guess Katie. Yeah. Okay, Casey, favourite memory from St. Eugene's? Uh, oh, going to choir and getting um, free cookies from old people. What's one thing that you're going to miss in St. Eugene College? Spending an entire media class just making memes. Favourite memory from this year? Yeah, no. How much have you spent at the tough shop this year? Well, Bianca, about <laughs> uh, too much. <laughs> too much? What song's your favourite bell? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever this one is. Uh, probably... ABC. Uh, probably Footloose. What was your favourite memory from primary school? Nothing. Liar. <laughs> you just said the water trough from prep. <laughs> I don't know, I can't remember. Fine. Who's your best friend in primary school? I can't even remember. Shirley Herpel. So girls, what's our favourite subject? Oh, mine is study for sure. Mine's music. Mine would have to be out of practice. <laughs> Who's been your favourite 2020 leader? Uh, probably maybe Ethan. Ethan's been, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. Who's your favourite triplet? <laughs> oh, uh, I'm feeling quite nervous in this situation. <laughs> um, best moment from being a senior Eugene? Um, where I had like 30 minutes to do something and so I went to the media room, recorded like a two second clip of me getting dragged out of the classroom. Good evening. Nice. Um, I have a question. Do you actually really like your nickname Bisho? Like, do you pride yourself on it? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, everyone, like, says it's pretty cool from what I remember, but, um, yeah, no, I'm always called that a cadet, so I don't really see a problem at all. Uh, it's a bit easier to get by than Lachlan, so, yeah, I like it. Nice. Um, what's one thing you're going to miss when you graduate? Um, well, being able to see my friends every day, um, but also being able to see my teachers every day, because I do really like uh, probably lunch times, hanging out with everyone, chilling. Um, <laughs> anything to do with Nick Clark? Ah, uh, thank you. And Steven, definitely. Um, any thoughts about Miss Walsh? Uh, no comment. Um, what's your favourite quote from you? I did the math, it checks out. <laughs> Have you made up the Sam after being your ass? <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? Lily, what's been your favourite part of this year? Um, I don't know, just getting to spend time with the cohort. Um, I don't even know what we've done this year. Probably the swimming carnival, to be honest. That was quite fun. Mmm, mm, the slow Wi-Fi. <laughs> Melanie, what's your favourite Miss Phipps moment? Every time, every single class, she's like, oh, is this all that we have today? Or oh, is this a whole class today when it's pretty much the whole class? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any. That's unfortunate. It's not very fun. It's not very yeah. fun. Yeah. Oh, okay, um, yeah. how much money have you guys spent at Tux Shop this year? <laughs> Ton. Oh! <laughs> Tom, how much have you spent? I'll say that. Um, probably like $300. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> load. Quite a lot. That's great. Okay, um, and what are you gonna miss most about St. Eugene College? Nothing.
Absolutely. Just crying. Absolutely. Just um, it up. Absolutely. Cool. Probably just like hanging out with the boys every day. And hanging mm -hmm. out with my mates. Yeah. And the cuddles. I have to keep the yeah. cuddle sessions. Yeah. Probably. Well, Alright. Thank you, boys. Yeah, no problem. Thanks for having me. Uh, I think I'm going to miss most is not being able to hang out with my friends at mm -hmm. school and then yeah. being able to spend time with them. And then probably also hanging out with all like the junior years and mm -hmm. trying to like spread. And uh, what's been your favourite school bell this year? Um, I don't know to be honest. So hi Luke. Hi. What's been your favourite part of this year? Oh, um, I said something. <laughs> <laughs> I guess growing. Uh, with all the difficulties and challenges. This is all for crooked photos for? Oh, This is a video. Oh, is You're in media. This is awkward. <laughs> I have a question. Because you're helping out the library, shouldn't this be more straight? I don't know. Hmm. So what's the video for? Nice. End of year. Right. Now when we graduate? Why didn't you film for media to like the table for? Because it can't be bothered. It's so annoying going to check. It's no, I don't. No, so I annoying don't. having like yeah. commitment to a subject yeah. that you Especially chose. Yeah, it's so hard to film. So, um, what are you guys doing? Filming you. Favorite memory from primary school? Um, would definitely have to be getting called Casey my whole life. That would definitely be it. Yep. Can't relate. <laughs> yep. What's your favorite memory from primary school? Be the classic iconic friend. <laughs> and what's your favorite memory from your 12? Definitely a top shop. Oh, yeah. I'll miss, I'm not gonna lie, I will miss everyone, seeing everyone, um, but one yeah. thing I'll miss the most. <laughs> Don't expose me. One thing that I will miss the most is hanging out with Miss Gilmore and the girls. Yeah, right. Yeah, miss. And what are you going to miss about the school? Nothing. Not a lot. And then what's something you're going to miss? Uh, my driver class. Amy, I have a message for you. do you have a message for Katie? Piss off. So, so Riley, how are you feeling today? <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, hey Mish, who's your favourite teacher for 2020? <laughs> Wise words. Okay, Ben, favorite teacher? Uh, Mr. Milliken, because he's a dank ass physics teacher. Uh, Johnson and Milliken and Orton. Um, that's hard, that's a hard choice. Uh, probably between Miss Watson and Mr. Milliken at this point. Hello, we're back with Brooke and Maddie because they're indecisive and difficult. Um, first question, who are your favorite teachers? Top three. Top three. Top three. Oh my God. Um, no. Um, so, <laughs> my favourite teacher would probably be Mr. Eden. Um, you go. <laughs> and then, like, Mr. Milliken, obviously. Yeah, and then Miss Kelly. Definitely yeah. Miss Kelly. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Definitely, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. Top three. <laughs> so, who is your favourite teacher here at St. Eugene's? Mr. Salotto. Miss Stewart. Uh, Miss Phipps. Miss Kelly and Mr. Solano. Oh, you like her. He's good. He's good. <laughs> oh, Miss Collier, oh, of course. Fipsy. Definitely Fipsy. Definitely Fipsy. Uh, my favorite teacher is uh, Miss Stewart. I know there's two different Miss Stewarts, but um, the one that left, that used <laughs> yep. to do um, drama. I... Miss McAllister? Yeah, yeah. Miss I... Nathan's pretending to not be offended. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm not. You're a close second. That's alright. Mr. Byrne. Yep. Mr. Salotto. Mm -hmm. Mr. Milliken. Mr. Byrne. Mr. Byrne. Where's, Miss Barge? Where's Mr. Salotto. Miss Barge sometimes. <laughs> no, <laughs> Jamo for sure. Well, one is Miss, Miss Kelly. Oh. For sure. For sure. Those lollipops. Hardcore. Definitely Milliken. Milliken? Yeah, his smile just makes my day every single day. Christian, you know, I'm gonna miss him. Um, oh, you know, Miss Park is actually pretty cool, even though she thought I graduated last year, but like... That's fine. Mm, Miss Wedge. Miss Wedge. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and... Um, no. Miss, yeah, Mr. Slotto. Yeah. Alright, favourite teacher? Um, uh... Oh, I have a lot. Miss Feggings is like an original. 
And then there's um, there's Mr. Neen that's not here anymore. Oh, with Jamo, so Mrs. McCosca, number two. Um, uh, who else? Oh, Miss Stewart, like the small one. Oh, that that was good as well. Yeah, she was nice. All right, thank you for your time. Are you in grade 12? So Ryan, who's your favourite teacher in St. Eugene's? Definitely Miss Wood, hands down. Favourite teacher? Uh, I'd say Mr. Milliken. My favourite teacher? Well, it's hard to choose. I, I kind of like all my teachers. Um, I'd have to choose between Miss Tucker and Miss Phipps. Teacher? Uh, probably Mr. Salotto. So Tyler, who's your favourite teacher? No comment. Okay. So I'm here with Michael and Flynn, and I'm going to ask you a question. Yeah. So who's your favourite teacher? Fipsy. Oh, Fipsy. Oh, okay. Um, Flynn. I love Peter. He's a sweetheart. <laughs> or Miss oh. Watson. All of them. All of them. All of them. All of them. Take two. Who was your favourite primary school teacher? Mr. Bravo. Probably Miss Masson. I'm going to say Rosie. Uh, Alright, here we are with School Captain Lucy. Uh, the question is, what are you going to miss most about St. Eugene College? Um, probably the teachers. Teachers? What about them? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Erin, we're filming! What? No, what are you going to miss most? <laughs> Muzz. Who's your favourite teacher and why? Um, I have my top three in this order. I've as best to least best. Miss Wood. And no, no, sorry, I made that mistake. I meant Miss Masson. <laughs> oh, and, and Dino. <laughs> sorry, I'm, sorry, well, I just really badly wanted to do that. Should I just continue? Yeah. Okay. Chelsea, who is your favorite teacher? Uh, probably Miss Kelly, Miss Stewart. Uh, Mr. Turn. Alright, so just to ask, um, what's your favourite teacher that you've had at school? <laughs> They're not even in the... Teacher, this is okay. This is Milliken. Yeah, Milliken. Yeah, Milliken. Who's your favourite teacher? Mr. Slaughter. Okay, so we're here with Regan and Taylor. And the question is, who is your favourite teacher? Miss Johnson. Who's your favourite teacher? Miss Nathan and Miss Stewart. Who's your favourite teacher? Uh, Miss Phipps and Miss Conway. <laughs> uh, what's your favourite class to teach? Um, I have three year twelves, but five of them are in three of my subjects, the poor things. Um, I do, my favourite subject to teach is methods, mm -hmm. but um, I do like physics and specials as well, but methods is my favourite. Who's your favourite student if you have one? Oh no, I'm not answering that question. That's way too dangerous. Um, <laughs> favourite student? I think it's a tie between Tom McGuinness and Tyler Rose. Um, uh, that's um, yeah. Both boys certainly keep me on my toes, make me think, make me cry. Um, <laughs> lost suit of ball patches. I think that's mainly Tom. Yep. Do you enjoy teaching chemistry? I do enjoy teaching chemistry. Do you enjoy teaching the students in the class? Yes, they're um, they're good students. Mm -hmm. The chemistry is always a lot of fun. That's good. Um, and hopefully, the kids have learnt something about mm -hmm. themselves and how they learn. Mm -hmm. More importantly, just chemistry. Yep. And <laughs> who's your favourite student? Um, as I only teach four of them, all four of them are my favourites. Um, <laughs> I can't pick one over the other. Mm -hmm. um, in terms of laughing at. <laughs> Flynn, we laugh at him the most, and it's always funny trying to get um, Taylor to answer a question in class. <laughs> it's always a challenge. Um, favourite moment with the grade? When we took the grade to the state futsal titles at Oxley. Oxley. Yeah. Yep. And we totally dominated by coming second, last out of eight. It was all great times. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is poo. <laughs> So you're going to go in a bikini in front of like an audience? No, it's just board shorts. I'm in a bikini. <laughs> can, you, can you edit that swear word, please? Yeah. I'm here with Mr. Friends, yo. So, uh, French Penny, Mr. <laughs> Friends, I'm calling. Uh, what's your favourite class? I don't have a favourite class. I hate them all. 
equally? Equally. I love to hate them all equally. Who's your favourite student? I hate them all equally. Oh, my favourite memory. School camps. Mm. Which one? In particular, grade 9. No one? Did I go on camp with you? Yeah. Well then, no, not that one. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, Sean, sir. I uh, appreciate it. Love you too. Love you too. G'day Year 12, how are you going? Congratulations on finishing your journey at high school. It's been a pleasure teaching you over the last few years. Uh, good luck on your travels and your adventures. Uh, wish you all the best of luck. Uh, remember to challenge yourself, have fun, be safe, take care, enjoy. So hi guys, I just want to wish you all the very best. I know that um, whatever pathway you choose, you're going to be successful. Always remember that you have a St Eugene family who loves you very much. Um, we thank you for the times that we've shared with you and for the memories that you've shared and left with us. They'll always um, be in our hearts and we'll miss you very much. Bye. What's your favourite memory of the Year 12 cohort? Uh, I think my favourite memory was the Year 11 formation when we did the Concord Award and the fact that Riley just took the lead and I did have to run catch up but it was probably the best memory I've got so <laughs> What is your favourite memory about the Grade 12 cohort? Well, look, I've known this cohort for the whole entire time since, since prep so they are very special to me. Um, they're the same age as my two uh, twins uh, that left St. Eugene after grade nine. So they are dear to my heart. I've seen them grow since prep. Memories of them is just throughout the whole college experience. Uh, look, you have swimming carnivals, you've got athletics carnivals, the competitiveness, the, night, the lovely nature of everyone, the resilience that they have with all the changes that have come through, not only within the college, but also um, the changes with ATAR the challenges they've all had with COVID. Look, I wish them all well. And uh, I think that they're a great bunch. And um, I love them all. And yeah, just all the best for your future. You've had a tremendous head start here at St. Eugene. So don't forget those beautiful ethics that we've taught you. What are your favorite memories? Um, favorite memories would have to be Kikoda. Mummifying Tay Tay and each of the three times that Tyler told me I was really good. I miss you. Well, um, well done on what's been a very interesting <laughs> final scene here and best wishes for the future. I'm Miss Wood, favourite student from media. I don't have a favourite, but all my favourites. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, favourite memory from teaching our class. Oh my gosh, I don't know. Maybe the most recent favourite memory would be Ryan struggling to stay awake from yesterday, so I said. The most frustrating memory anyway. <laughs> okay, um, do you have a message for our graduating class? Um, don't be afraid to think big. So Year 12, it's been a pleasure to work with you over um, the past 12 months very closely, but over the last three years. I'm wishing you all the best in your endeavours for the future. I know that you will be successful in all that you do because you've got that great um, drive within you to make the world a better place. I wish you all the best and enjoy life and look after yourselves and each other. Bye. So this was your favourite memory? It's really hard to pick one favourite memory. I mean, I loved Year 9 Business, my first class here. Year 10 Kayaking um, Retreat, I think that everyone has a favourite memory from that retreat. Um, year 11, don't know if there's a favourite memory in there, but definitely this year there's been, you know, Flynn's Christmas present, the formal, and just seeing you guys leave to, um, this week, so, yeah. <laughs> just sigh, I you the final message from the Great Falls. I just wish you all the best in whatever pathway uh, you go down and I hope that everything that you want to happen comes through. So, congratulations. So, do you have any favourite moments in the Grey Tales this year or a message you'd like to say? Thank you for the question, Erin. Um, 
My mind goes back to endless hours of trying to get footage with the U12 PE class, particularly in volleyball, to get all the things we needed to get for verification. That was a great time for us all. Um, but really, I think just uh, have faith um, that things will work out in the end. If it doesn't, it's not the end. So keep working hard and you'll be fine. Hey guys, it's Erin and Alani here, the Dunley and Carroll House leaders. Uh, I mean, as we all know, this year has been a bit of a shit year, but we do have some things to be grateful for. For example, our year 12 formal. Our swimming carnival. Our athletic carnival. Our Kairos retreat. Our spirit days. Yeah. Um, our Kelty way that we haven't yet to do, but we still get to do it. Yeah, our teachers first students, you know, because we're like, and our families actually get to be there for our yeah. graduation, which we didn't think was possible. Mm. And now let's take a look at some great memories from this year. It takes a beat or not by no more to put them all away Rushing me around and sending me astray Don't you lie to me as we finally Got a handle on the doors that we open and shut Packing all my suitcase cause I'm going far away I'm going to a place where the credit cards Don't decline on me as we finally Got a handle on the doors that we open and shut Secluded in this far away place Heading to a land where everything is okay Don't think suddenly that you and me Got a handle on the doors that we open and close Can you take a little time and go balance your ways Cause everything we do when we put on display Maybe you and me are a little the same So what do you think of or what do we make? She Took her time, took my mind, forget my Me and my frame of mind, took our time
first on one of my teachers Used to fantasize, making love with her behind the bleachers And to all the people who ain't like me, I ain't like me either Half my class was having kids, guess we had that jungle fever uh, I was waiting for my graduation, uh, growing impatient uh, What I did know was this grown up world this cool was just cool world. in a blown up world this There's still gossip, there's still drama, yeah. there's still problems There's a right and there's a wrong There's still people that I think won't love me till I'm gone I can almost see it, that dream I'm dreaming But there's a voice inside my head saying you'll never reach it Every step I'm taking, every move I make feels lost with no direction My faith is shaken, but I, I gotta keep trying Gonna keep my head held high There's always gonna be another mountain Always gonna be an uphill Oh god <laughs> the struggles I'm facing, the chances I'm taking, sometimes might knock me down, but no, I'm not breaking. I may not know it, but these are the moments that I'm gonna remember most. Yeah, just gotta keep behind going this text and, and the meaning is slow and steady wins the race.
Let it go Let it roll right off your shoulder Don't you know The hardest part is over Let it in Let your clarity define you in the end We will only just remember how it feels Our lives are made